Hello, I'm Daniel Watrous, and in this video I'm going to show you how to view transaction history and details in Authorize.net for WordPress. So from the dashboard in WordPress, you scroll down on the left until you get to the Authorize.net menu. If it's not expanded, just click the little triangle arrow over on the right, and then click on User Subscriptions. And what you'll see here is a listing of all of the transactions that have happened in your system, and they're separated out by user. So each time there's a transaction, you'll see whether or not it was a recurring transaction. And recurring transactions, as you'll notice, will include a subscription ID and a payment number. All of the transactions have a date, and they all have an auth code, which is a value that Authorize.net produces to validate this transaction. They also have a transaction ID. So notice that with this transaction ID, you can copy this value and come over to Authorize.net and from their search menu, scroll down and just paste in that transaction ID. Click search, and this will pull up the transaction in authorize.net, at which point you can go in and look at all of the details of the transaction. From this screen, you also have the opportunity to refund. You can also go into the subscription ID link here and edit the subscription details, which is also how you would cancel a transaction like this. Each time a new recurring transaction is processed by Authorize.net, they'll send information to your website so that it'll show up here associated with that user and that particular subscription ID. That's all there is to viewing your subscription details. Thanks for watching.